All right, <clears throat> let's move on with number 36. 2 times the natural log of x minus the natural log of 5. Once again, it's very similar to the one we just did, number 35. I can't put these together. I can't use the quotient property, right? There's a minus there, and they're both natural logs, so they have the same base. But I cannot put them together because of the 2. I must get rid of this 2. And the only way we can get rid of the coefficient is to make it an x one. So this is going to be natural log of x squared minus natural log of 5. Now you can put them together because now they have no coefficient and they have the same base. So it's just natural log of x squared. See the minus there? That means division. So x squared over 5. And that's it. There's nothing else you can do to simplify that. 37. 12 to the power of log base 12 of 1. There's a couple of ways you could go about this. Okay. Uh, see the exponent? Uh, the, it's, a, it's a power with the base 12 to the logarithm with base 12. So the bases match, which pretty much undo each other, right? It's like taking the square root of a square. They cancel each other out. So the answer is just one based on that rule. Because this, uh, the exponent raised to the power, to the log of a base 12 will give you just whatever the argument is. Another way you could solve it is to say, well, this log base 12 of one, any log of one is always zero. So this is just 12 to the power of 0, which again is 1. So either way, you get 1. Number 38, log base 5 of 10. There's really not we can do here. It says write as a single logarithm and simplify if possible. So it's already written as a single log. The only thing that we can do here is to calculate what it is by changing the base. Log of 10 over log of 5. And log of 10 is just 1, because again, if you don't write the base, the base is 10, right? So log base 10 of 10 is just 1, 1 over log of 5. And that's as simple as we can get it, but we can also do the uh, approximate solution by punching it into the calculator. 1 divided by log of 5, my calculator says 1 divided by log of 5 is just 1.43. 4, 3, 1, usually three decimal places because when we're calculating logarithms, every single decimal place uh, makes a big difference. <clears throat> Let's move down. 39. 7 to the power of log base 7 of 30. Once again, notice that the base of the power and the base of the log here that is in the exponent match. When that happens, the answer is simply whatever the argument is there, which is 30. That's it for that one. 40. Log base 4 of 64 to the third power. What I'm going to do here, let's see, which way do we want to go? Uh, what we can do is bring the 3 down. Okay. 